the new stage rack, 24 channels of RME, 12 mic Dante. Brought out to a hardwire microphone splitter rack panel in the rear with microphone inputs split to the front panel jacks for the RMEs and also to this 120 position EDAC. Power, primary and secondary Dante network connections on the rear. Ethercom. Each microphone input has a ground lift switch for both the direct and the split. We pull power and we'll notice the blinking lights inside are still flashing because built into this rack is full 12 volt battery backup supplies for both 12 mic Dante's as well as dual ethernet switches internally. All systems inside this rack have 12 volt internal power via these two battery supplies here. Incidentally, also powered by 12 volt or AC power is an M2 Mac mini running Dante Virtual Sound Card for full 24 track backup inside the stage rack. Back around the rear. We can open this panel and see. back of the mic splitter. And also the ubiquity managed switches that run the primary and secondary Dante interconnect. Those are PoE power supplies right there with uh, USB-C backup power for those two ethernet switches and then AC power distribution inside. This rack sits on stage with feet on the sides and also on the bottom, so it can be vertical or horizontal, with everything buttoned up and all the LEDs shut off for discrete stage splitter slash backup recorder operation. That's the new stage rack. Over at the control room, away from stage, we have the new control room rack, which is the um, based on the Digiface Dante, you'll see in a minute in the back of the rack. Uh, the Digiface Dante connects to a power over Ethernet switch here, which also uh, gets us Dante network functionality for, among other things, a Midas M32C which is handy as a monitoring mixer via iPads or other means. There's the remote control for the 12 mic Dante's incidentally. The M32C is optionally controlled by the X-Touch or the X-Touch in turn can control total mix. That slides away in there. A uh, O2 headphone amplifier, a travel router, and that's our secondary backup Dante network switch. Round back of the control room rack, we have the connectivity. Control room IO is via a Shure Dante interface. Lithium battery UPS, keeping everything up and running during power outage. Primary and secondary stage link, snake connection to the 12 mic stage rack. LAN connections for utility purposes. A WAN connection for facility network connection. Control room monitor outputs, power in and through and a Thunderbolt dock for distribution of the second monitor from a laptop or other workstation. And underneath here is the Digiphase Dante, uh, mounted half in and half out on a hinged rack panel for maximum space utilization. That panel hinges open, revealing the innards of the Digiphase Dante and the other connectivity, as well as power distribution and uh, other odds and ends inside the rack on removable trays for easy maintenance.
Good timing with this traffic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's perfect. It's gonna happen. Right, Ken? Yeah. As soon as Ken gets back from his trailer, we'll just keep rolling. Yeah. <laughs>